We was on the bottom, yeah. Now we headed to the top, new level. On my level, don't see anybody. I don't see him. This right here can never stop. This could never stop. Hey, this right here can never stop. Hold up, nah, nah. Hey, this right here can never stop. Hold up, nah, nah. Hey, this right here can never stop. Hold up, nah, nah. Hey, this right here can never stop. Hold up, nah, nah. One time, one time. Hey. I live on a job, right? Yeah, I'm always at work, right? Real people stay by me, right? Haters wanna do hurt, right? No, they trying to stop me, right? Drag my name through dirt, right? I don't feed into the hate, right? I just answer with a smirk, facts. I feel so special, facts. I know my worth, facts. My bloodline royal, facts. We the kings of the earth, right? You can't stop this, nah, nah. You can't stop this. What's your race? African American. African American. All right. So we're gonna show you. That our history is in the Bible. Right. Us going through slavery, being sold, right. being put on ships, being taken from the west coast of Africa, that's all written in the Bible. Let's show you. Deuteronomy 28, verse 68. The book of Deuteronomy. How you doing, sis? Hi. What we're going over, we're going over that we are God's people. That our history is in the Bible. I want to, say, fact, I want to say one thing. Go ahead. Now you listen to me. White people didn't put us in slavery in Africa. The weaker tribe and the stronger tribe took the weak and sold them to the British. So you're saying that Africans sold Africans? The Africans are the ones who did what they did. Okay. okay. We're going to handle that too be because that's all in the Bible. I got it. Move, man. I got Hold it. on. Don't, don't make a statement. Then run and we'll give you an answer. Joel 3 and 3. Yeah. Now, let's see if it was Africans that sold Africans. Because I'm going to tell you right now. Matter of fact, look right here. Look right here. You see how you see Arab, white, and African? Right. Guess what? Africans didn't sell Africans. Africans sold the Israelites. That's right. right. The so-called African Americans, when you go by that sign, God calls you an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. You're not African. That's just what hey, they yeah. put on you. Read. Verse 3. And they have cast lots for my people. So God's people, the Israelites, they were put up for slavery. They were put on the auction block. Read. And have given a boy for an harlot. Uh -huh. And sold a girl for wine. Because when you look at history, like right here, you see how they're selling us? They will make us breeders to breed more slaves. And for the, our sisters, they would breed them, and then when they got drunk, guess what they would do to them? They would rape them. Okay, so let's read on. Yay, and what have ye to do with me, O Tyree and Sidon? Oh, wait, God makes it specific who sold his people. Read again. Yay, what they have you to do with me, O Tyree and Zidon? Tyree and Zidon, those are, those are African nations. African nations sold the Israelites. We are all the coast of Palestine. So you had Africans that sold us and Arabs yeah. sold us. You know, but who did they tell us to read on? Will you render a recompense? And if you recompense swiftly and speedily, will I return your recompense upon your own head? God said, you trying to get back at me? Because if you're trying to get back at me by selling my people, I'm going to judge you. But read on. Let's see who they sold us to. Verse 6. The children also of Judah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The children of Judah, which are so-called African Americans, and the children of Jerusalem, which is everyone else on the side, all the way down to the valley, have ye sold unto the Grecians? The Grecians. What race are the Greeks? Bring it out. The so-called white man. Yes. Right. So look right here. You see how we have Arab, white man, African. These are the people that sold us. Right. These are the people that put us on the slavery. Right. It wasn't Africans that sold Africans. Give me Exodus 11 and 7. No, yeah, because bring it out. what? We might be black, just like them, but we're not the same. Right. Yes, we are not African. We are the Israelites to the Bible. Hey, we are God's right. chosen people. In fact, even God said there's a difference between us. Read. Exodus chapter 11 and verse 7. But against any of the children of Israel, against the Israelites, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, shall not a dog move his tongue. Shall not a dog move his tongue. These other nations, they should not speak against us. That's right. Read. Against man or beast. Uh -huh. That ye may know now that the Lord doth put a difference. A what? A difference. A difference between who? Between the Egyptians and Israel. So between the Africans and the Israelites, there's a difference between us. That's right. Let's see what that difference is. Because we admit we were sold into slavery. Africans didn't go into slavery on ships. Right. Let's see who did. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 68. Bring it up. Let's see a difference between the Israelites and the Egyptians. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 68. Uh -huh. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Wait, wait. It said that God will bring them into Egypt again. 
What were the Israelites doing in Egypt? Yo, I did. Give me Deuteronomy 5 and 6. Let's see what they were doing in Egypt. Deuteronomy. How you doing, brother? How you doing, brother? What's your name? Larry Thompson. Larry Thompson? Yeah, I got, I got something to do. I appreciate hold it. Hold on, hold on. We almost oh, come on, man. Please, shoot on our brother. That's it. He's something important. My hand cough. My hand uh, died at 40 years old. All right, I got you. But well, listen to this before you go. Before you go. But let me introduce you. Brother Slane, he knows what we're talking about. So, Larry, what we're talking about is our history is in the Bible. We look over here on this side, so called blacks, Hispanics, and Americans. We're the 12 tribes of Israel. We're God's chosen people. And we're about to show you that our history is in the Bible. Because, Larry, how do we get over here to America? I got you, Larry. Hey, bro, as you leave, listen to the scripture. I'm going to show you. Read. Deuteronomy, 28. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 68. Uh -huh. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. So God said we bring us into Egypt again with ships. When we were in Egypt, we were slaves. When we got to America, guess what would happen to us? We were slaves. They put us in the cotton fields and they made us work for them. And they made billions, trillions off of us. Read again. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again uh -huh. with ships. With ships. So the so-called African Americans, we went into slavery on ships. Matter of fact, what's your race, Larry? Black. Black? Yeah. Guess what? This history, this happened to our people, right? Yeah. So we read about it in the Bible. Let's see if it's talking about us because it's saying people will be sold, will be taken to slavery on ships. But we know once we got off those ships, what happened to us? When they took us off the slave ships, what happened to us? Hey. Look right in the sign. See this right here? We're being it sold. It says cash. They sold us when we got those slave ships. Let's see if the Bible talks about us being sold when we got the ships. Read. By the way whereof I spake unto thee. Man, as he said with ships, it's going to go down the exact same way. Read. Thou shalt see it no more again. The ages are homeland. We have not been back to where they took us from. We did not go back to Africa as a people. We've remained here in America. Read on. And there, and there, wherever that ship took you, read. Ye shall be sold. Ye shall be what? Ye shall be sold. To who? Unto your enemies. Larry, who are we sold to? Who are we sold to? Wait, say it again. We were sold to the American, the so-called white man. We were sold to them. God says they are what? And there you shall be sold unto your enemies. God calls them our enemies. Read on. Fish out. For bond men and uh -huh. bond women. Slave men, slave women. And no man shall buy you. And nobody will redeem you from this oppressor. Because we had Martin Luther King. We had Malcolm X. We had the Black Panther Party. But we have not been saved from our oppression. We're still getting oppressed in 2021. My brother, how you doing? I just want y'all to say I'm going to be something to you. Know what Go to, I'm going to show you that by you knowing this, go to me 29.1. Let's see who God said this will happen to. Did God say that African Americans will go through this? Read. Deuteronomy chapter 29 and verse 1. Huh? These are the words of the covenant. So what we just read, the people that went into slavery on ships, that was a covenant made with them. If they disobeyed God, curse will happen to them. We read that and we know that that's talking about us, right Larry? So let's see what God calls us. Which the Lord commanded Moses uh -huh. to make with the children of Israel. Wait, who did God say going to slavery on ships? The children of Israel. No, African Americans. The children of Israel. No, the black men in America. The children of Israel. Larry, what does God call you? Okay, what did the Bible just say? The children of... No, read it again for me. The children of Israel. Larry, you're an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. Right. That's your nationality. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission, minor murmuring, omitting and missing the mark. 
Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.